you. Did anyone have any good progress with their game yesterday? I'm, I might get time to work on the game. Uh, Brainoid! Oh, we need to listen to Brainoid's new track as well. He did Danway. It's Danway! Danway or the highway! So that's ready for the for the covers. We're not allowed to call it karaoke. It's covers. We're doing it. It's a Brainoid and Honest Dan collaboration. And I've also learned uh, it's almost impossible to get a good sounding vinyl scratch. Oh, were you trying to do DJ Lethal? Bring it on! Work, 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 work. <laughs> Off as well. Brainoid Games, thank you so much for the donation. 20, 20 schmackaroonies. Let's add that to the total. You are look how good the tree looks, by the way. Ah, look at all of the, look at all of the, how gorgeous is that? Lovely. And I was like, no, this is corpse. He loves the olives. <laughs> Hello, corpsey boy. <laughs> no, I just banned someone called Oliver. So I got confused. <laughs> I was like, is he donating with some hate Fortnite messages now? <laughs> Here we go. Look how soft I am. Ah, oh, I could do this all day. <laughs> and you can't. No, even if you donate money. But it is a glorious little number. Keeps me snuggly. And this is what I will be wearing for the day. I think it stops there. It's, it's reasonable. It's not a full blown uh, furry outfit. <laughs> ah. So there we go, at least I get to cover my hair now. So the one thing we need to do with our wonderful ranger outfit is we need to find the red nose to go with it. Special, you do like to feel it. Redemption, you want a minute of Welsh? Okay, fine. Ach, ich kann mir nicht auch like. Dim problem of gubble. Dim problem of gubble. Uh, I'm going to go to follow the Gwerth for all Gita Volchidi, Rydi Alchivi. We might be in a position where I can, I might open Unreal Engine. I know that sounds crazy. You hear it here first, but we might open the Unreal Engine. I, I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm just being silly. Maybe I'm being silly. Maybe we shouldn't open the Unreal Engine. Um, okay, uh, game ideas. What are we going to actually do for the game ideas? So the theme is dream, right? Um, so what, what kind of thoughts come along with this? I know I came up with the gem, but I generally, theme, but I generally didn't, I didn't have much more thought than that. So dream. Uh, I kind of like the idea of like, uh, like a young kid's imagination where you can you, you envisage yourself as being like a hero. So that allows us to do things like you are a hero. Uh, this could be like RPG setting if you want. It could be against monsters. It could be set in space and stuff. Fun dreams of floating, flying, stressful teeth falling out. Really? <laughs> okay, so dreams can also be a, a, a place for concerns uh, and worries to manifest. So one thing I was kind of keen to try and experiment with is trying to make like a controller, like a player controller in a game where you are moving around in a wheelchair, like a wheelchair with two wheels on either side of it, not like an electronic one. And I wanted to bind both of the joystick inputs to as if you are pushing or pulling the wheels on either side. I'm not too sure how I could, um, how that would work. But I thought it could be interesting, the idea of like, you know, you have to, to go forward, you, you flick you flick them upwards together, if you will, and if you pull back on one, you'll turn sharp right. I need to breathe sometimes, I can't keep going do-do-do-do-do-do. <laughs> oh yeah, you can have me into a lovely wobbly, wibbly wobbly aubergine if you're interested in that sort of thing. There we go, okay. So I can look down at myself, there we go, that's what I kind of wanted, right? And then we can move around. At the moment, we're just 
I mean, you could always do a game where this is your perspective anyway. Um, but I'm, I'm interested in seeing if we can work out some interesting controls around this. So for this to work, when you turn, we don't want it to turn your character. We just want it to move the camera, right? So let's see if we can work that around. Yes, can you see? Right. So we got this movement. Oh, cow. Holy cow. Good. Okay, so we can only move forward and we're looking this way. Okay, to help, I, like we are going to keep figuring it out. I feel like I want to make a little bit of a simple model. Just so it helps give a bit of perspective of what we're trying to do. Do we roughly see what I'm going for here? Like a leg perspective? Whether we need a little bit more crotch. Not in a weird way. I don't know if you can get that sentence said in a non-weird way. We need a little more crotch. I see legs now that you say legs. <laughs> now we're gonna give some shape to a butt. I just wanted to do a block person, but this is typical me. <laughs> it's fine, it's fun. The point of the game jam is to have a bit of fun too. Believe it or not. Contrary to popular belief. Next time you're only allowed right angles. <laughs> Even on the wheels. <laughs> yeah. I think, to be honest with it, we will keep the top bit simple. It's sad, isn't it? Because it's so easy to not be aware of this stuff. It makes sense as well. It's very difficult to to dwell on the problems of the world and other people all the time. It's a very human thing for us to compartmentalize in that, but um, yeah, definitely good to have reminders every so often, right? It warms my cold heart, says so speak. 11-bit badger, wow, 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 thank you so much for that donation. 40 pounds, crikey. That takes us to 550 pounds total. Let's get some love in the chat. Thank you very much for sharing your generosity. It goes to a good cause for sure. Oh, <laughs> oh dear. I've turned into a, into a creature accidentally. <laughs> you guys can't see this. Let me hide. I accidentally undid my, um, my mirroring. <laughs> what was a wheelchair? <laughs> Someone's sitting, sorry. Not even in a wheelchair. It's turned into this. A creature. <laughs> I've been looking at this inventory menu for three hours. I'm <laughs> I have been looking at this inventory menu for like three hours and I might cry. So let's, let's see what happens with this to begin with, shall we? Save. Does this rotate our chair? Oh my god. <laughs> I think I'm rotating too fast. What do you reckon? <laughs> I'm doing donuts in the in the car park. <laughs> so I feel like we need to try and get a bit where we limit the um limit the camera the player controller from going too much further than like a ninety. All right, let's see if this works. Random idea I had as a way to control it. Nope. <laughs> I still keep turning. Any luck? <gasps> oh no. Okay. It it worked. Oh, it's not letting us turn left. Oh, that's fine. It works. <gasps> it works. I, I didn't even do the left side. That's why. Um my gosh. I guessed I guessed how to do it. Mom! Mom! I did it! I wanna do the same thing here, right? What the flip? Is that a, a, a five hundred dollar donation by what looks like a hex value? <laughs> Holy smackaronis, what? 
I I have no idea. I sorry, the the alert isn't going off, so I'm going to try and play you the uh music myself cuz it's not going off. Have... Wow. Hello. Uh thank you for an absolutely massive donation. Holy smokes. Uh <laughs> Thank you very much for donating to a wonderful cause. Uh, yeah, special effect is our charity this year, helping uh, people with severely, uh, who are severely dis uh, disabled to have more of an independent life um, by using technology and accessing games as well as just normal technology uh, so that they can get a little bit of independence back in their lives. Um, oh, you, you saw the video earlier. Yeah, it, it summarizes brilliant how much a little bit of a difference can make into those lives, uh, into those people's lives. Um, uh, like, I don't want to be a streamer who, who like cries on stream, but generally, like uh, watching those videos does make me a little like I can feel the teariness. And I'm like, no, we're gonna hold it together. It's all good. It's all good. Um, wow, I guess is all I can say. <laughs> Do you want a bauble on my on my tree? <laughs> Ooh, okay, so I think we were we were trying to turn left when we got very politely interrupted by a massive donation. Uh, shall we try and carry on with that? <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. Let's see if it works. There we go. So. Oh no! Again, I can't turn left. <laughs> Why? Okay, this is fine. I just get to a point where it doesn't let me anymore. I think I know why. It's because I went slightly over and then it, I can't move it. It blocks me from moving back because it's the same calculation it uses either side. Okay, we got a new problem, <laughs> but we can solve it. But we can solve that problem after we try and do some of these redemptions, eh? So, uh, we got wonderful donations today. Thank you, people, for supporting the stream. Um, and as a result, it means that we have... Uh, a couple of uh, milestones here. So, we... Uh, Reindeer Dan has been here all day. Uh, I am now going to play a horror game. That might be tonight. I don't know. I'm finished. We might do it Monday, just because I'll have more time. If we do it tonight, I start at 8. And it might be a little too late. I need to think about that. See how I'm feeling. But we need to play a horror game. We're going to have the Honest Dan Game Expo as well, which will be another evening. I need to go and shave my beard. And I need to do a Welsh lesson as well at some point. Alright. This reindeer's got a trim. Oh my gosh, my... My belly fur is covered in hair, and not the good type. I've really got to lean forward doing this. This is weird. The razor is out. 100 pounds right now to knock one of those brows off, mate. No, Craig. You gotta stop. Misha was totally right though, you're all weird enough to want to watch this. Wait, okay, I gotta brush my belly off. There <laughs> you go. Isn't that magical? Uh, da, 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 da. Let's first go and also look at the fact that we are now on 100 subscribers. Thank you. Uh, I've been trying to get that for like two months now. So uh, very much appreciate. So I'm really grateful for them for that. Yeah, it's one of those things that, it, like, it, probably, it definitely it, it takes money and, and setup to make a custom setup for someone, but. Knowing that, that without their help, they wouldn't have been able to to 
have a means to to pursue that that kind of passion or their interest or their way their, their way to like socialize with people uh and to enjoy themselves uh it's really nice because like once it's done it's done you know they they, they can do it uh, and they can re-engage in a way that they used to or that they've always wanted to let's have a look at progress anyone who checked progress pictures in the discord we will be having a look at them thank you thank you for the follow manager so softer mince has been working on he's got a present on the floor uh wonderful uh oh hang on you in 3d now <laughs> I only just thought about it. You're in 3D. You have a gift can. Is this what you collect? Oh dear, what happened here? What happened to your soft mints? <laughs> All right, soft mints. Do you want to do a screen share? And we have a chat about it. Or just like an image. And probably Dave, thank you very much for five gifted subs. Boppy Games, The Artifacts, Dead Pixel, uh, Dead Road 12, and Maxa Bajillion. You've all got subscriptions. Thanks to probably Dave. Just so while well, you find that, I'm just going to jot uh, his name down. Thank you, Davsky. Very generous of you. Uh, remember, every subscription, I give a pound of that to charity. Nice up, but there we go. Cool. Problem solved. Get blown away by this, no? Mate, you got more. You got more than me. Where's the box, Dan? It could Where be anywhere. Where is the box? I it don't know. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's the box. Get the box. And oh, what can you get? The box. Oh, gifts. Gifts. You got one of the gift. gifts. Go get the other gifts. Where's the other gifts? Oh, it's only spawning one at a time. You can't when you game. Random. What is this game? <laughs> oh my word. No, it's wrong. Oh, for flip's sake, it doesn't. That doesn't work. We're trying to imagine how it would be. How different forward uh, and backward movements on a wheelchair. So this is top down on a wheelchair. You've got your two wheels either side. Uh, orange is like move forward with the left wheel. Purple is move forward with the right wheel and the light colors uh, move backwards. So these are the different combinations of how you could control the wheels. You can either push forward on both, forward only on the left, forward only on the right, uh, forward, left, backwards, right. Yeah, you get it now. Okay, good. So I'm just trying to imagine what the movement would be like. Okay, so we can go forward and I don't think we go any faster for having two. I think that might be, be because of um, a cap on the movement speed, possibly. Like one is considered the top. The top. So we might um, need to half it before we feed it through. Yeah. Okay. So we can go fast. We can go fast with both sticks. We also want a mechanic where you've got to push. That's what I kind of want, where you don't know, just hold to go forward. It'll only, like, if you've been going forward for, like, a second, you, you'll have to release and re-push again. So it'll, like, count how long you've been pressing forward, or that it's been more than zero. Uh... Yeah, it'll count per input how long it's been uh, more than, or oh, non-zero. And then it'll require a reset before you, like, as in to simulate the grip. Maybe just do that. You take the left from the right and times it by a, a scalar. Okay, we're having a bit of a party. However, it is promising. Let me slow it down. <laughs> So if I press both forward, I don't rotate. If I come off of one, I turn a bit that way. Do the other one that way. Um, and if I go both ways, I go faster. I think I do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's kind of good, right? Hmm.
Yeah, so you don't just press left to turn. That's it. That's how we gotta pull our chair back. I mean, it kind of works. It kind of works. Now I don't know how that's gonna work when we m combine it with the movement as well. So individually, it kind of works. Game. Okay, so it's going choppy. Forward does that. Backwards does this. If I let go of one, and I just go back with one, it does that. If I do just the other. We do both at once, I go faster. I think it's kind of, I mean, it's not, it's not like soup. I'm sure I could improve it, but. I find it interesting. Um, Cause you can use the analog sticks to kind of control it very elegantly then. Now the thing I want to add to it is that you, you have to push And I don't know how that's going to work. Because it doesn't really take in, into account momentum. Hmm. Yeah, that, that's, a, that's a tricky one. When doing both at the same time, you would spin on the spot. But if I was just doing one, you would be looping around. the. So if I'm moving my right forward, I'd be moving around the pivot point of my left wheel. <gasps> a donation, Jamad! Thank you, sir! Very much appreciated, my love. Okay, let's see. Does this work? Da da ba da 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 da. Okay, here we are. <gasps> it works. We have it. We can press the right bumper. You look that way. Left bumper. You look that way. Both would do that. Ooh. I think we probably need to slow it down a little bit. It's a little bit too fast. But uh, yeah, thank you everyone for being here. We've raised a lot of money, haven't we? It's been a good one. It's been a good one. Um, and let's give a little bit of uh, credit to people who have supported the stream today. Uh, we have... We have Brainoid Games. We had Dubout, we had Corpse, we had 11-Bit Badger, we had 0x746564, we had an Anonymous, I know who it was, thank you. Uh, we have Merlin, we had Jam Hats, we had Apollyon, we also had five gifted subs from probably Dave, Fire or Dark Matter sub as well, along with Apollyon as well, thank you kindly for that. And we had uh, a couple more bits as well in the shape of Softer Mints if I remember correctly. So yeah, it's been a good one. Uh, and in terms of our milestones as well, we've made some great progress. We're, we're rating this individual based on kind of um, us talking about people having different accessibility um, kind of setups in order to allow them to still enjoy things, even if their disabilities make it challenging. So yeah, let's get over there and say hi. But um, we're on 900 and 65 pounds it's been an absolute pleasure chat thank you very much we'll be back tomorrow and we will get to a thousand i'm sure and you'll get to see me looking like a wonderful 2000s emo boy it'll be wonderful all right have a good one